Hi there everybody, Lori Baracco here and I'm going to share my thoughts, my predictions, my psychic insights for the week of December 8th, 2019 and I am using my Gilded Royal Tarot deck to see what cards come up and give them a little bit of a shuffle and we'll see what collective energies we'll all be working with this week. Alrighty, so we've got three from the top and okay so as we wind up the rest of this year this decade um there are different uh, themes we'll see kind of like we're, we're reviewing different themes and it feels like there's a little bit of a disconnection for many of us it's like we're sorting things through and different things are popping up right um randomness and 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 we may be questioning our own intuitive connections with our divine selves so that 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 looks like that's kind of the theme that will be continuing for all of us this week the first card i had selected is the seven of cups which can bring a little bit of confusion and feeling a little disorganized and i said it's like there's all this randomness that can be um coming through for us and we may find ourselves having a hard time grounding and focusing so i'm going to encourage you to work with your root chakra stones and spend time outside and anchor yourself wearing red and even black is good because it absorbs all the colors but it helps us stay in the here and the now then the next card we have is the High Priestess Reversed. We may be wondering, hey, where's my connection? Where are my guides? Where, I, where, where are you guys? Where are my spiritual helpers? Where are you at? They're there. But there's a lot of this sorting through that's still going, going on here. This reprioritizing of our soul's journey at this time. And um, what hasn't been... Um, anchored within our frequencies is really front and center. So there's, again, there's the, the remapping, the replanning, the reintegration of our essences as we move forward into the new decade. And the last card we have is the Three of Swords Reversed. Now, um, we may find ourselves really sensitive and on edge and a little bit defensive. Spirit wants us to know that we don't always have to look for the negative or the challenges or um, wonder what exactly that person means by that. Like, and our sensitivities are probably going to be turned up, but it's important for us to give uh, people and situations the benefit of the doubt. And even if you know better and know that the that probably somebody's trying to work you or whatever or they're being dishonest that we have the choice of how we uh react and we don't have to fight come at them with the same energy we can take a higher consciousness approach which is part of that revamping that reorganization and and all the things i spoke of earlier so um Okay, so try to ground yourself. Let's all try to ground ourselves. Let's, you know, allow the review of the past decade to come, come up and, and, and take a look at that and do our very best. And, and um, again, try not to take things personally. And don't forget to smudge yourselves. Saging yourself and cord cuttings and so on and so forth will help us not take things so personally. All right, everybody. I'm Lori Baracco, and I look forward to seeing you soon. Namaste.